CBS News Bay Area. This is the Evening Edition. Now at 5, rainy days and Sundays bring more flooding and mudslides to already hard-hit communities. And all this rain is leading to a lot of sewage spilling out onto the streets to potential health impacts for people living in these communities. And we're not done quite yet. Darren Peck has the latest on the last storm, ready to move into Northern California. Appreciate you joining us. I'm Brian Hackett. And I'm Andrea Nakano. It's because of those storms still on the way that we remain under flood watch through Monday. As we take a live look at conditions across the bay, as it has been since the day after Christmas, it's wet. It has been that way all weekend long. Some areas getting hit hard for the second or third time in as many weeks. Like in Nevada, where a portion of Highway 37 is closed this evening in both directions between Highway 101 and Atherton Avenue, officials are working on clearing the flood water off the road. They've set up equipment to pump water from the highway, and you can see it's extremely deep in some areas. This is very common for that area. So Caltrans says heavy rainfall led to nearby Nevada Creek overflowing the levee, and no word yet on when that road will be reopened. And as I was driving,